What's up guys? So I managed to get my hands on a set of butterfly motors. I looked on the internet and I can't find any reviews on the motors, so I thought I'd do my own review. So the first part of the video is going to be an unboxing video, and the second part will be some flight footage. If I haven't put the two videos together, then check up here for a link, and that will be for the flight footage, or they'll be in the description below. But first of all, let's get started with the unboxing. Okay, so um, let's get these unboxed and see what you get inside. So you get a packet with a motor in it, and then inside the box you get a nut, four screws, four washers. These are the M3 screws, six millimeter long, to one side. And then the actual motor is, uh, the stator is 22 wide by seven high, so these are 2207. Uh, they're 2500 kV, uh, gold on the top, blue on the bottom, you get a 19 millimeter and a 16 millimeter spacings for that. Um, on the side, you get the butterfly logo, and on the other side is completely plain. So you just get that logo only. Um, there's a hollow shaft. You can see the, uh, the design on the top there. Silver color windings. Um, the wires tend to be quite long actually on these. Let's get them a measure. So they are approximately 120 millimeters long so uh, quite a long wire in there so if you were using a 4-in-1 ESC that's not too bad um, yeah really nice motors actually They're really nice I don't know how much they weigh but I have got some scales so we put them on the scales to see what the weight is of them so we just pop that down there I'll zero that and we'll see what these come out at with the weight uh, let's pop them on there and they are 38 grams, um, so quite a heavy motor actually. Um, I do have a Hyperlite motor to hand, um, and these ones have got even longer winding, even longer sorry wires. So we pop that on there, and that's coming up at 34 grams, so about five grams heavier. Um, and these are again a 23. Uh, where are we? These are a 2307, so um, but they're only 5S rated ones. So a little bit heavier, so probably more aimed for the freestyle. Um, I'm going to put these on a racing drone of mine, so look out for some footage for that. Um, but yeah, they are quite a nice motor. Um, really nice design. Uh, these are made by Exfoot, I believe. Um, I've already got some Exfoot motors, so I know what they're like. They're um, yeah, quite nice motors, actually. Um, I'll put the specs of the actual motors in the description so you, everybody can have a look at that um, and then I'll show you what my Xfoot motors look like um, just to give you a comparison um, for colour and stuff like that um, so these, this is an old Xfoot motor I had and if you have a look you can see uh, the same gold there so the same sort of windings as well inside that so this is uh, motor. If you have a look back at some of my videos, you can always really see the X-foot motor. So yeah, that's the Butterfly motors. So um, stay tuned for part two and we'll have a look at some flight footage for them.